Let's see. Okay. Yeah, it is just kill uh, harpies and devourers until you get it. Yeah, but what's the drop rate? Uh, the wiki doesn't show any drop rate. I don't see. Yeah, there's nothing about drop rates anywhere on the internet. All right, well, let's do the harpies first. It says a whole bunch of them can be found in the sulfur core. Okay. All right, it looks like there's no specific drop rate being listed, but it is seeming to suggest that the drop rate isn't that bad because people seem to get them relatively quickly. There are 43 POIs in this zone. Jesus Christ. Wait, so where are we going? Um, it said Sulphur Quarry. I don't know if we've actually found that yet. Maybe that's that spot to the north up there that looks like a Sulphur Pool. I know, I see where Leo of the Forgotten is. And just south of there, there's a whole bunch of devourers. Okay, where's that? Um, remember where all those ghosts were? It, it's called Leo of the Forgotten Waypoint. Well, that's where I got my devourer fang. I didn't get one. Right before we attacked the hero point lady. I wound up not getting- I didn't get one. Well, there's devourers here, so let's yeah, they, find some. Uh, the wiki said there's a crap ton just south of you. Did it actually say crap ton? It, well, it didn't say the phrase crap ton, but it said there's like live groups of them everywhere around here. No luck. Aha, I got one. Well, that didn't take very long. Yep. Okay, now we just need harpies. Yep, now it's just harpy time. And I do not know where the sulfur quarry is. Um... Let me see... Northwestern. Oh, we haven't actually explored it yet. Is it in that northwestern corner? It's in that northern. It's, that it's like in yeah, it's in that area where you put your waypoint. Yeah, that's what I thought. Because okay. that looks like yeah, her that's, area. That's where it is. Alright, it's fine. Back to the dark lens. That's where we're going. Alright. We're going that way anyway, that works out.
I don't know how you're doing that. Skills. <laughs> I'm going up here and I'm going to give this to the guy. Okay. Never mind. Never, right, never, never. Oh. Did I kill these elementals? There we go. Try that again. Without elementals trying to murder me. What? What do you mean unknown command? Okay, so um, kneeling is not it. You have to salute. Ah, okay. We we did it Let's at see. the same time, so I wasn't sure which one it was. I'm pretty sure it's the salute. It was salute. All right, there we go. I gave him the uh, pristine thing. Okay. Alright, to the north. Harpies. Oh yeah. Wow, there's harpies all over the place over here. Oh wow. Holy cow. I have seen people saying that either this drops on like the first two or three that you kill, or you're not gonna be getting it for like two days. And there's no in between. Get anything at all from that guy. I didn't get anything from any of those guys except for one. Well, I got an intricate totem and a pulsing brand spark, whatever the hell those are. Yeah. This one, I, I, we'll see, but this one seemed to, people were suggesting that, like, a lot of people get it first try, but there's a lot of others who legitimately are stuck here for like two days. So it might be, it might become one of those things. We'll see. Wait, winning chest. Aha, I got one. Very nice. Also, I got an achievement for killing a hundred wipes. Got it. You got it? Hey. Yep. Okay. I'm glad about that. I was a little worried about that one. Warcraft quest is complete. Ah, it was nothing. Nice. Yay. That's six out of ten. All right, so we need to keep going north. Okay, give me a sec. Three. Four. Five. 
Is it? Okay, okay. Alright, I'm good. I just wanted to make sure I had counted everything up right. Going into the sulfur quarry is probably not going to be springer friendly. Yeah, that's fair. I mean, it might be. You never know. You never know. I think we have found ourselves in a hole. It's fine. You need to go north and you Hero challenge. Oh, look at that. A lone broken egg. It looks like it's been here a while. Whoa, a lot of a lot of ads. Taking out the ads first. So we've unlocked that part of the map. We don't have to go any further north. We do have to go up to get the vista. Yep. And then there's one more POI and we're done with this area. Up we go. How far up is the question? I think it's on that rock maybe. There it is. Oh, I'm in combat with something. Damn, right. even have space to mount. There we go. All right. Well, it's not pretty, but it's different. It is different. This is like a weird... I like the design of this zone. Even though it's not pretty. Like, it's weird because it's <laughs> ugly, but it's not like... Bad ugly, if that makes sense. Oh yeah, it's not like um, Hellfire Peninsula in World of Warcraft. Yeah, it's not like... It's ugly, but it's not like, you know, just downright bad. Like, it's somehow good ugly. <laughs> okay, so we need... I need to switch to my skimmer. I will make it down there. Right. On a 
honestly, the skimmer is just awesome. I mean, he's so slow on land that it's really hard to swallow, but he avoids attacks. He doesn't take any fall damage whatsoever. Here's a POI that I didn't even see. That was the POI we were going for. It. Oh. Why is it that big of a range? What the hell? I thought my... I thought it was uh, closer to my mark. It was on... It is closer to your mic. It's right next to your mic. But the range on that POI is absurd. Mm. Oh well. I'm so busy extolling the virtues of my skimmer. <laughs> oh, here I have over here. There we go. Okay. I guess we could just keep following this path. Sounds like a plan, Stan. I don't know why I went up here, but I did. Because uh, the path ends right here in this corner? What is another way to? Nothing here. The toilet kind of looks like we can go this way. Can we go this way? It kind of looks like it dead ends. But there does seem to be a way over here. Nope. Wait. Why does it look like there's like 18 people fighting this thing over here? There might be 18 people fighting that thing over there. Oh, it's just a bunch of mobs fighting themselves. Oh. Alright, well, that seems alright. There's a thousand hyenas right here, so... Surprised oh, there's not a POI here. I'm just gonna keep hugging the wall. It's working so well for us now. Hmm. What's a watcher, Wraith? I don't know. Broken shelf. tell when we get to a spot that the skimmer likes because he just goes <laughs> going so much fast. <laughs> zoom zoom! Whee! This is the bottom of the map I think. Is it? Yep, that's a wall. Yep, wall. I can't see anything over here. Yeah, I can't see shit. Oh, this is better. Sand Jackal Run. Oh, this is where you get the jackals. Is it? Yeah. Saint Jackal run and I see a jackal mount indicator. We went around a waypoint somehow. I don't know how we did that. Oh, I see it. The 
is the last waypoint. Uh, POI and hero challenge over there. Yep. Two POIs, actually. Alright, we'll start with that one. Okay. Something about this tree is strange, perhaps it's the way it thrives in a place of so much ruin, or perhaps there's something in the air around it, a shimmer of magic. Examine. Okay. Okay, go get your P.Y. that you missed. Yep. Got it. Alright, we'll grab this one to the north. Can I... Get up, please? There we go. Up. Yeah, I see that. Oh, we can get up over. I made it up. Did you? Yeah, I switched to a springer and jumped up. Yep, got the POI. This was not part of the plan. <laughs> I was trying to figure out what the hell you were doing. <laughs> I was going to kill the elemental while I waited for you to show up. Instead, I fell down the cliff and I am now floating in midair. <laughs> hey, whatever works. I can mount and I can jump off. Woo! Well, I was going to suggest using the waypoint, because okay, that's what I did. I'm back. I just shot 2,000 feet in the air. Let's go get you a jackal. Jackal time! There's, jackal a, there's, time. A, there's a mastery point down here, but that might be... I think it's out. Never mind. Yeah, we need to go up. Yeah, I was like, I think that's up, actually. Probably no. 
little too quick on that one. There we go. Get up. Um, hmm. Now the question is, how the heck do we get up? I'm already oh, up. Okay. What your deal is? Oh, I do not like these stairs. You have to use. I a, do not like these stairs at all. You have to use a skimmer to get up these. There we go. Wow. Okay. First off, POI. Right here. Hand in rune stones and unbound energy. Run over wisps. Use the jackal's pounce skill on tormented dust devils and destroy remnant. Okay, so the jackal. Kind of similar to the raptor, except when you press your space bar to jump, it's going to teleport you forward. Um, okay. Give it a try. Or maybe you have to earn that ability first. <laughs> no, it's just not pressing. I have to press V. Yeah. Right. So it's going to teleport you forward. You have to use that teleport ability to get through the sand portals. Okay. Um, as far as I know, I've never actually done it because I just learned that <laughs> ability. Okay, hand in runestones, unbound energy. Is that a wisp right here? Yep. Need to deal with the torment and dust out. Clearly, that was not the way. Let's move out. Oh no. Okay, got the tormented energy here. Okay. And another wisp. Got it. Okay, seriously, what are we supposed to do? Jackal's Pounce skill on Tormented Dust Devils. I've done that like three times and it doesn't do anything. Oh, I have to double press. I, you have to double tap space to get the link to work. Oh, okay. That makes sense. Double tap space to get the Tormented Dust Devil? No, I double tap space to link to teleport. Oh. To Again, not working. Use the pounce skill on the dust devils is what it says. I know. I've done that about 18 times now. Are they bugged? I think they might not be, I think it might be bugged. 
Ugh. <laughs> What's up? Uh, there's a bunch of unbound energy on top of these pillars. Oh. You have oh. to do the double spacebar jump to reach him. And I missed. Of course I did. Oh, this is quite coy. Okay. What? Alright. Alright. I have to start. I have to do this a bit sooner because I keep overshooting it. Okay. Got it. Oh wow, I can do that super fast. Yeah, until you run out of energy. Be very careful. Hey, why am I glowing like this? Okay, I saved that. But how do I save it again? Okay, there we go. Wait. I just got a dust devil. What? How did you do that? I just double blinked and landed on it. I'm mostly just running around collecting the uh, unbound energy stuff.
I double blinked myself off the platform entirely. I almost did that, and then I was able to blink again to get back on the platform. That's why I was like, oh god, I saved myself. How did I land there? Oh no. Unbound, the jackals are vicious forces of nature. They will strip the flesh from your bones if given the chance. But once bound, the jackal can be broken and its essence saved. Aha! I got the heart. I would like to extend my deepest gratitude and greatest respect for the help you have provided. Being as old as I am, people seems as brief and brief and as brilliant as shooting scars. Stars appreciated for a moment and then lost to memory. But you stand out in the haze. Your kindness and spirit remind me how inspiring people can be. I don't think I will forget you. By bonding with your jackal, you'll have the very wind and sand as your ally. This is an enormous gift, so be wise and careful. Good luck and come back to see us if you'd like more training. Dvaj Corps Spirit Squall. Okay. And then I got mail. You've done everything we've asked. You have proven you have the heart to ride a jackal. Return to me and I'll sell you a jackal saddle. May Abaddon's torment always fear you. Dvaj Corps Spirit Squall. And yes, I know where they are. Oh, I am glad I didn't buy that. Whoa, the jackal's expensive. Do you have an Huh? What do you say? Do you have enough? I do. It's 200 trade contracts and 20 gold. That 20 gold is surprising. Holy cow. Thank God. Okay, I got the, uh... I've got the jackal. I'll see you around. My friend, we need to speak. Now that you have a jackal... Congratulations. Um, covert missions I have for you. Please see me back at the palace. Dodge core spirit scroll. There's like a whole side quest thing going on there. Let's look at the jackals and see what we've got. Mounts. Jackal. The Shiver Peaks one isn't that bad, actually. Oh, that's awesome. Wait a minute. I see you and your jackal are bonded. Treat it well, and take pride in knowing you've 
turned Abaddon's darkness into a force for good. Oh yeah, I forgot that we bought the tiger for you. That's aw okay. <laughs> hey, you need to dye him red. Yeah. Or at yeah. least make his stripes red or something. I do still want to see what the other available things are. How do I, how do you even look at, like, what are all the available jackal options? Um, press A. A? H. Okay, I did press H. Go to mounts? Well, yeah, but I mean, like, the available ones that are, like, on sale and stuff. Oh. Uh, let's see, uh, the Mordrum Alpha is on sale. Um, yeah, nope. <laughs> <laughs> okay, hold on. Okay, you're looking at it. I'll find them for you. Okay. I just want to see what options there are. Because the, the tiger is pretty cool, but... Eh. Well, that was why we, I mean... That was why you got it. The tiger? Because you were like, oh, the tiger! No, I got that. Oh, I got right. that for the bunny. Um, Canthan Vulpin Jackal Mount Pack. What's it called? One of like I'm I'm writing one of them right now. Um, oh, Canthan Vulpine. Yeah. Okay, so Canthan Vulpine is an orange one. Yep. The Lucent Vulpine is the one I'm on right now. Okay. And the ring-tailed vulpine. Okay. Um, the pack gives you all three. Well, I really like the vulpine ones, actually. The orange one? Well, like I said, the pack yeah. gives you yeah. all, it gives, all three. It gives me all three, and I was looking at the ring-tailed and loose, and it's like, oh, I don't really need to choose. <laughs> right. If you, you know, if that's how you want to do it. Uh, let's see what else they've got. Alright. Um, the Exalted Lay Hunter. It's the Exalt, like your, uh, Skimmer. Yeah. The Exalted yeah. version. I think I've got um, a whole pine so far. Uh, the Liminal Moorhound. Nope. Okay. Uh, Alloyed Quicksilver. Not, not bad, but nah. Vabian light paw. Okay, that one's actually kind of cute. Um, hold on. There's more. There's the title light paw. Oh, title. Okay. Eh. Uh, okay. the desert Sheba. Looks like a Sheba, you know. 
Yeah, nah. That's it. That's all that's available right now. Okay. I would go for the three the three pack. Yeah, right now my uh three options are the first light paw you mentioned, the three pack, or you know, just the tiger I already have. Um let's see, so there's that. The three pack is the better deal in terms of cost. Okay, hold on. Okay. Um. I think I I think I'm gonna go with the three pack. Just let me double check. You know, I say that, and you know how I always say that, and I'm like, eh. <laughs> well, I pretty much have a lot of the jack. Okay. So if you want to look. The the only, the two I'm torn between are the uh, three pack and the light ball. The this is my, ball. my tiger at the moment. Okay. It's not easy to see in this light, but that's actually navy blue rather than black. Okay. Wait, if we step outside, it might be a bit brighter. Like over here near these fires. It still looks black. Yeah, it still doesn't look great. Okay. No, I know. I mean, it looks great, but it's not. It's not blue. It doesn't look blue. I kind of see it a little bit, though. The bull? Oh, wow. Again, this is dark, dark blue. You can tell by the tail. Yeah, the tail looks a little more blue. Yeah, it's just showing up black here. Um... My favorite, or one of my favorites. Yeah, that one's really cool. It's not currently available. Yeah. Of the ones that are currently available, there was, um... Is that the ring one? The ring tail? It's the ring tail, yep. In blue. The ring tail looks really cool. That's the Canth and Vulpin. Okay. In blue. In blue. It doesn't look blue, it looks black. <laughs> uh, I have a luminous one. Okay. Oh, okay, that one actually looks really cool. <laughs> yeah, I've, I've got some really pretty ones. That one's pretty cool too. This one's um, it's like Japanese themed. Hmm. It's called the Kintsugi. Uh, this is the Dark Mist Moorhound. I actually think this one is available. Dark Mist Moorhound. Oh, that one looks really cool too. Uh, 
Um, lucent sand. Lucent sand is very lucent. Yes, he is. Bridge back. That one's pretty cool. A lot of these are really cool, actually. I know, that's why I have <laughs> them. You can't just pick one, you know? It would be easy, but no. You... Sunstalker. Eh, that one's alright. That one's a little... I don't know about that one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that one that one's not a favorite. This one's available. One's this is the cool. alloyed quicksilver. This one's also available, the Vabian Light Paw. Yeah, the Vabian Light Paw is one of the ones that I'm pulling between. This one? Yeah, that's one of the ones I was looking at. Um. Wait. Because it's between that and the uh, Volpine 3 pack. Like I said, the Volpine 3 pack is going to be your better option. Can I, can I see the three pack? If you have, I mean, you've shown me two of them already. Well, this is my favorite one. I ride it all the time. Yeah, that one's really cool. Yeah, this is the one I ride all the time. This is the first of the three in the three pack. He drops little hearts when he does his little thing. Oh, does he? Yep. Oh. Yeah. Um. This the ring tailed. Okay. It's probably hard to get an idea because, like I said, they're the colors are so off here. Yeah. I think I am gonna go with the three pop. Oh, he also does the heart thing when you jump. They're more like pedals, but... And this is the orange one. Well, it would be orange. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But yeah, I ride that blue one all the time. That was my favorite. Yeah. Um, what else have we got? We've got the Mastiff. Okay. Three hundred dollars. Doggo. Puppy. Puppy. Looks like a Saint Bernard more than a Mastiff to me. Boy, boy. Um, the mirror. He has little butterflies coming off of him. Aww. Can you see him? Yep. Uh, let's see. Banded Mist. That one's cool. I think you already showed me that one. I haven't actually. Some of, a lot of them look alike. Oh, okay. Yeah, a lot of them have this armor thing on them. Um, because I'm going in order. Oh, Here's okay. a crowned ancient. Kind of looks like a dinosaur. Yeah, that one feels more like a triceratops. Yep. 
a mini Triceratops. <laughs> <laughs> the world's smallest Triceratops. This one is called Polished Stone. You see, a lot of them kind of look alike. Yeah. Uh, let me see. This one is called Pyroclast. Hmm. Um, it's supposed to be lava. Oh, okay. So, like, he drips lava. But, you know, when it's blue, that's what it looks like. Huh. Um, Stardust. That one's not bad. Just has the basically the constellations on him. Yeah. Um, yeah, a lot of these would look better with different colors. But it's just picking up the colors that I have on my current mount, you know? Ah, uh, yeah, true. Like, I didn't actually go through and dye all of these the same color. They they just pick up whatever I, my current mount colors are. Okay. Um, this one's called Twin. Mm -hmm. This kind of looks like a puppy dog. Papa! That one's cute. Uh, only have two more. Shiver Peaks you have. And the basic jackal you have. Mm -hmm. That's it. Those are the only ones I have unlocked. There's still several that I don't have. But my favorite is... One of the Volpines. Yeah, I, I'm, I've, I decided on the three pack. I think that's going to be your better choice. Yeah. Oh, he wants to play. Does he? Um, alright, let me send you the three pack. So, like, if you pick this one and do red, then we have matching mounts. Yeah. 